More than 40% of women in the United States have dense breast tissue. And that can often mask potential cancers on a mammogram. But now doctors are testing new technology that could help spot trouble during screenings. CBS's Daniel Nottingham shows us how it works in Health Watch. Relax this time. Stacy Herkert has a family history of breast cancer, so she makes sure to get a mammogram every year. When my mom was diagnosed, she made us promise that we would go annually for checkups, and, and we do. Like many women, the 54 year old has dense breast tissue, which can make screening for breast cancer challenging. Women with dense breast tissue have more white glandular tissue on the mammogram, so the background appears white. The problem is, Breast cancer also appears white. Down the center. Herkert is taking part in a study at the University of Southern California, testing a new three dimensional ultrasound called SOFTVIEW to try to help doctors more accurately identify cancer tissue. The patient lies on their stomach and the breast is placed into a warm water bath. In two to four minutes, the machine scans the entire breast using sound waves. There's no radiation exposure and there's no compression of the breast. Researchers are enrolling 10,000 patients from eight sites across the country, including here at USC. Researchers are comparing patients' mammogram results to the SOFTVIEW scans to learn the machine's effectiveness. There's no exam that's 100%, but we want to be as close to 100% as possible. If the technology is proven to be effective, it could eventually be used in addition to annual mammograms. Danielle Nottingham, CBS News, Los Angeles. If the FDA approves it, researchers hope that the test cuts down on false positives from using handheld ultrasounds alone.